Hi everyone, welcome to the Monday Wrap. We are back and we're back out on the outer oval actually. That's the Aces uh, playing out there behind us against the Wellington Firebirds. Five down I believe at the moment, but Luke Ronke smacking all over the place. So interesting time. If you get a chance, get on down. But let's rip into it. First off, performance of the week. Ton of centuries going on at the weekend. And uh, Andrew DeBorda, another 100 for him. That's his third of the season, 122 for Howick Pack. Terry Crabb, his second of the season, 121. Uh, Sean Cotter, 135 for Eden Roskill, another great effort. Um, and Michael Guptill Bunce, his first for the season for Cornwall, 142. Uh, some bowlers out there as well. Josh Kunis in uh, school cricket picked up 6 for 12, fantastic effort. Uh, Donovan Grobler, again, 5 for 21, plus 48. And James Nolan picked up a 5 wicket bag for Suburbs, 5 for 25. But just for uh, sheer numbers, we'd have to go with uh, Michael Guptill Bunce's 142. Honourable mention also in Premier Reserve grade for Neil Brisbane from Ellerslie. Fantastic, 172 not out. Brilliant effort by them. Also, some fantastic results uh, for our women over the weekend. Neil, tell us more about the Hearts. Yeah, the Hearts uh, started their season down in uh, deep, deep south in Vercargill. Uh, they unfortunately lost their first 2020, but they bounced back well on Saturday and Sunday in the defence of their title. Uh, there was career best fi uh, figures from Georgia Guy with the ball, and then uh, a top score for the Hearts ever for our white fern Katie Perkins, and then Megan Tremaine was. Uh, excellent in both games with bat and ball so the girls are, are off and running two from two and well on the way to retaining their title and they go down to Masterton uh, next week to play the Central Hinds so good luck to the girls down there um, but a guy that's probably itching to get a go at first, first class cricket is Donovan Grobler Yeah we're saying you know could he be the next pick, could he be the next guy putting on uh, Aces colours in the near future he's had a fantastic start to the season picked up 22 wickets and that was before he picked up that five wicket bag uh, at the weekend. He's already scored over 200 runs and as we said he got um, just 48 so almost picked up another 50 uh, with the bat. He's been training with the Aces uh, pretty much all season on the back of that form and uh, if they're looking for another all-rounder I think the Aces could do an awful lot worse than him. He's been around Premier Cricket for quite a while and uh, it looks like he is in the prime form of his life at the moment. So uh, maybe you heard it here first. Donovan. Go for it, mate. Hope we see you in all Aces colours uh, very soon. Uh, but uh, just to wrap up this week on what's a very windy, hopefully you can hear us down here at the Outer Oval, uh, some other people have had some success, and it's the end of the season uh, for one form of cricket, secondary school cricket. Who took out the honours, Neil? Yeah, well, congratulations to Westlake boys. They went undefeated through the, the two-day portion of the competition, and the Robbie O'Donnell-led side uh, picked up the title. They uh, won it last week after the rain, and that meant that Auckland Grammar couldn't catch them but regardless of that they decided just to beat Auckland Grammar just to be absolutely sure so well done to Robbie and Johan and everyone else at Westlake for uh, picking up the title and, and breaking the King's streak. Fantastic stuff and just before we go we have to say we weren't able to do it last week because we didn't manage to get a Monday wrap out but big apologies to Gareth Shaw we missed him out for performance of the week a couple of weeks ago 9 for 16 one of the outstanding performances that we'll probably have all this season possibly this decade and I'm sure probably the best one that Gareth's ever going to have in his career so apologies for not getting it in there but a belated performance of the week to uh, Gareth it was a fantastic effort in uh, Premier Cricket a few, a few weeks ago that is us for another week and uh, we'll catch you next time on the Monday Wrap